Uh, in this topic, we'll talk about how to use a MOBUS control Delta MS300 or multi function input, uh, MIO, you can say digital input uh, function. So, for MS300, if we want to uh, use this uh, MOBUS control MI, then you should use the firmware version uh, newer than uh, version 2 uh, or onward version. Okay, relative parameters. Uh, for the uh, frequency command source and the operation command source uh, 00, 20, and 21, here we should set to uh, 1 and 2. That means uh, IS485. And actually, for uh, 00, 21, this one you can also use the other function. But for the uh, frequency command uh, 00, 20, you must set to IS485. Then, how to uh, control the multi function input? Uh, all we can say digital input, then uh, basically related with uh, these uh, three parameters. Uh, two uh, dash 12, uh, two dash uh, 74 and 75. Uh, two uh, dash 12, this one just uh, define the uh, di digital input uh, uh, work as uh, normally open or normally closed. Uh, for the default setting is uh, zero, that means uh, all the uh, multifunction input or digital input is uh, normally open. Then uh, come to 2 uh, dash 74. This one just to define the internal and external uh, selection. So if you use the uh, one, that means you define this um, MI as uh, internal. Internal means uh, we can use a MOBUS to control, but if you define with the uh, external, means use the physical wiring, then uh, we keep a uh, zero. So in today's example, I will define in the uh, 511, uh, okay? And 511 can refer the definition over here. So, but today I'll basically just uh, show you the MI1 to MI7. And next is a uh, 2 dash 75. This one is the uh, internal MI control. So you can consider 2 dash 74 is uh, defined and then uh, 275 is to enable the function. Today's example will just show you uh, with the MI1, uh, MI2, and MI3. Okay, and then also the mix. Next uh, will be the parameters related with the uh, multi uh, step speed. So for the first uh, step speed, we'll define 4 hertz. Then second step speed will be 8 hertz. Third uh, step speed will be uh, 16. And the last one is uh, for 32. Here is some uh, basic setting, and we just keep for the default setting. So first is the MOBUS node ID uh, for 9 double, and then for the bow rate uh, is a uh, 9 uh, dash 0 1 is a uh, 9.6 means a uh, 9 6 double and then the protocol is a uh, 7 now to ASCII in parameter 9 dash uh, 0 4 and as I mentioned we can enable the function through uh, 2 dash uh, 75 so the mobile address of this one is a uh, 0 or uh, 24 B so if you don't know the definition, you can check our user manual. Okay, so here we mention how to calculate. So example, this one, uh, uh, 0, 04 dash 10, then that will convert to uh, 0408. Okay, let's move back. So this already mentioned earlier, uh, we have to define the internal or external uh, internal means we use the mobile controlling external use of physical wiring and today we will just uh, simply use uh, mi1 mi2 and mi3 so we use this mix and so here you can see the multi uh, step speed for the first step speed means uh, only mi1 on then uh, second uh, speed is uh, mi2 on then the third uh, speed means uh, MI2 and MI1 are both on. Then the uh, fourth uh, speed is uh, MI3 on. So we basically just use uh, these uh, four values to control. And then uh, I will also show you from the DIA uh, designer for the scope function. So you can see here we monitor with the multi-step speed. So you can see 
the value will show 4 and the frequency command I will show 32 as mentioned here and I also uh, control here HMI so here we will select the uh, MOBUS one and define the protocol as uh, 792 uh, with a uh, bow rate 96 or uh, double and here we'll select the uh, ASCII hex address so this, uh, this one as I mentioned for control uh, parameter to dash uh, 75 and the mobile address would be uh, 24B so you can see here if we enter the 16 uh, 16 means uh, MI3 on so it will go to the 32 okay now we we'll switch to the software so this one as I mentioned uh, we select the ASCII hex address and then define the is 45 7 down to 96 double okay and then for here also enable the VNC function okay so now we can connect to VNC uh, default password is uh, from 1 to 8 okay so as you can see, we can change this one to uh, 4 Then frequency will be 4 Then I will open the uh, DI designer So here you can see we select the corresponding port and define the port way and protocol with the uh, ASCII mode And it was Okay, so it will uh, successfully detect the model Then we click add And after that uh, we can uh, click here then click trace and here we will select the multi step speed then second one we select the frequency command and then we can uh, click or start so you will see now the value is uh, 1 and 4 4 means uh, 4 hertz ok then we can back to VNC so now we change the value to 8 So you will see now the multi step uh, become a 2 and then frequency change to 8. And here we use the 12. You will see now become 3 and 16. And if we change to uh, 16, it will show 4 and 32. Okay, so this is the first method. Uh, second, we can use the uh, software to control. So example, then you will see uh, 2 and 8 then here we change it to C means the 12 and then if we change to 10 uh, means uh, 16 so you will see become uh, 4 and 32 so that's all for uh, today's topic thank you